What is going on everybody? My name is Mike. This is Wall Street Traders where we break down hot trending stocks to put you at advantage on the market. All right, so nobody left any uh, stocks for me to break down this week in the comment box. So I'm going to be going over the same ones from either yesterday or the day before. Uh, so stay tuned for that this morning, you guys. I did start a little late this morning and I apologize. But today's ticker symbol that we're breaking down is C or I'm sorry, SNDL or Sundial. Um, I have my lines and graphs already set for you guys. Remember, we always start from a daily time frame so we can see the overall direction and picture that our stock is in. We do not want to be trading in a vacuum or basically blind. Uh, and I will always um, remind you guys of this every video until it sticks in your head because this is such an important thing to know. So let's go ahead and dive in, you guys. So this red line down here represents our major, our last major uh, support line up here is where the channel that we're in right now so this also represents our major major support line and then up here at the highest point that's been tested this is our major resistance lines and these all can be tested by looking left like beyonce says if you look left we have a candlestick that came up got rejected and ultimately pulled back to where we're at right now we have this candlestick we have this one in the same vicinity we have this one and then we have about two on the opposite side working as support because once you break through resistance it becomes support and then we have this one down here so we want to count at least three to be uh, considered as a heavy tested area and then down here obviously we have our two new candlesticks from today and yesterday uh we have this candlestick let me zoom in so you guys can see this better this candlestick bouncing off this level you can see it hit this level and then bounced up here pulled back into this level now we're kind of just consolidating but i'll get into where we're at here in a minute uh, we have this candlestick back here we have this hammer hammer stick candlestick in this area and then two more on the support side and then two on the resistance side so this is these two uh, uh levels right here are heavily tested and uh, as we can see right now they're working pretty well so since we came down bounced up pulled back into our support level which is a double test uh and so far we haven't failed and we haven't broke through this level we did over here it was a kind of a peekaboo so we have like that that uh, that tail peeking through but other than that the penetration that we made from the previous day uh if we would have seen this gap below and hit uh, our resistance then we might have been in some trouble but now that we're kind of consolidating if we look at the penetration of this candlestick from this morning it's about midway from the previous day so this is a good sign that means that buyers are stepping up and uh hopefully we can change the full direction of this stock you can get in right now i'm sorry for that you can get in right now. I, I would say this is still an amazing, amazing buy. Uh, two weeks ago, I had predicted that we would hit the 92 cent level, like legitly 92 cents in specific. And uh, we ultimately pulled back straight into that. Oh my goodness. Straight into that night. Oh my goodness. What the heck? I'm sorry about that. Uh, into that 92 cent area you guys and so far it's looking good um if you decide to get in right now like i said maybe have your stop loss below this 86 cent level right below this this tail that we had previously so that way if it does break below this uh and things do go sour you're able to be tagged out and out of the trade but ultimately like i said i think this is a really really good buy buy opportunity as of right now if you're swing trading or day trading i would set your first target to maybe around dollar six or even the dollar 22 and that is our minor resistance level and then if you're core trading or uh uh long-term trading if you plan on holding for a longer term then obviously the dollar 70 would be your first target and then from there you would wait for another entry uh so forward and uh, i really hope that you guys enjoy the videos that i make really quickly just to kind of break down exactly what you're looking at like i said before put stocks in the comments so i can break them down for you guys this gives me something to do for you and uh, ultimately hit that like and subscribe button 99 percent of you that watch my videos continuously uh forget to hit that button and uh, if you hit that button then you would be updated every morning for every stock that i break down so don't miss out i will put you at advantage of the market or try my best to uh, but other than that you guys have a beautiful day and happy trading